What's happening guys, Levi from AMX and we are back with another awesome build. We're gonna take this standard DRZ and build it into the ultimate off-road super tour. Now AMX has hooked us up with everything from their catalog, be it storage, electrical, GPS, tires, and protection for the bike. This thing is gonna be an absolute monster when we're out on the trails, and it's gonna keep our rider nice and comfortable. What's the first step with transforming this bike? Stripping it down, let's do it. Now that we've got the bike stripped, we can actually see what we have to work with. Now, in regards to the radiator guards, you can actually see that they're factory OEM guards and they're plastic and they do the job, but not that good. Luckily, Force Accessories has actually hooked us up with these lightweight aluminum ones that's gonna take those, uh... well, it's gonna beat the plastic ones. <laughs> the laser cut front grille means you're gonna get plenty of airflow through to your radiators, but will also prevent any sticks and stones from getting through and damaging those radiators. This bash plate is a single piece of pressed aluminium with an easy to use single bolt removal system. What that means is you have an easy access to your sump plug and your oil filter. A lightweight aluminium discard will prevent the disc being damaged when we're sliding off rocks or logs. Now that we've got all the armor fitted onto our DRZ, it's now time to do some electrical fit out. Now, with the bike completely stripped, this is the best opportunity to route all of our wires and get a nice clean look. Let's do it. We managed to do a heat to this bike. A bunch of bolt-ons, but it really did change the look. Well, it was great to get this thing out here and put it through its paces and see what this thing could actually do. Now, I was given the challenge of taking this DRZ farm bike and turning it into the ultimate super adventurer. Let's have a look and see exactly how we did it. First up is traction. Now, I decided to go with the Motos Tractionators, which is an 80-20 split tire. Basically meaning it is primarily an off-road tire and only supposed to go on the tarmac when riding between trails. Then, we've got our protection. We decided to go with Force Accessories protection gear, primarily our radiator guards, which will help prevent puncture of the radiators themselves, and also a lower bash plate here, which will help prevent bending or cracking of our lower frame. Moving up from there, we go to this huge long range safari tank. This means you won't have to carry any extra jerry cans, you simply carry it all in the tank.
Now, storage on a bike is always a major concern for those adventure riders. Luckily, there's a brand out there called Giant Loop, which has a huge range of soft luggage storage. We've gone and fitted this thing with a tank sack. We've also fitted the saddlebags and we fitted the rucksack. This means that we can carry all of our supplies even a couple days worth. I wanted to make sure that whoever's riding this bike can stay in control. So we fitted some RHK pegs and we've also gone and fitted the steg pegs. Now steg pegs give you the advantage of being able to lean your weight towards the back of the bike, keeping all your body weight off of your arms so you can stay out for much longer. Moving up to the bars of the bike, as you can see, we fitted this thing with a nice tall windscreen. What this is gonna do, it's gonna help prevent wind from hitting our rider and causing early fatigue when you're out on a long trip. We've also fitted this thing with the Denali spotlights. These things are very, very bright and will illuminate any dark track you might find yourself on. In regards to indicators, we've also got the quick removable indicators. What this allows, when you're out on track, you can quickly pull these things out, put them in your sack just so they don't go missing. With the grips, we decided to fit Oxford heated grips. These things have a number of settings. So if you're out in the mountains or even out in the snow, you can turn the heat up or down depending on how cold you are. In regards to the GPS system, yes, your phone has Google Maps, but this thing has every single trail on it. When it comes to cell reception, if you don't have any reception, this thing is actually satellite connected. So you will always know where you are, where you've been, keep track of kilometers and keep track of hours the bike has been running for. We've also got some bark busters just to help protect the knuckles. Also rear view mirrors, just to keep it legal. Well, there you have it. This thing performed exactly how we thought it was going to. We've already done a little bit of riding on it, but as she sits, it's ready for its next adventure. All of the accessories are available at amx.com.au or in store. Like always, guys, I'm Levi from AMX. You get out there and ride safe.